Welcome to No Lose Playoffs. Da -da -da -da. The X is an ally, global 40 out of box version. Choosing the X's forces. Von Buren Buren. Blue moon on Germany. That's Germany and Italy. Grandmaster Bert. Hey Bert. Ernie. That's Japan man. The allies, the warden as the UK and Russia. And me as the rest of the boring ass time. Allies so far, but not this round. <laughs> round four, finally. Ugh. Shall be the US and China's turn. Ugh. Finally. Get to the war for the US. Well, Axis forces, you woke up a sleeping giant. But let's see what happened on the previous turns on round four. Well, Germany. And just commit Operation Barbie Roses. <laughs> Tee -hee -hee. Da! This is good! <laughs> Barbie Roses! Or Barbarossa, if you want. If you will. <laughs> uh, that's uh, Von Buren's trophy wife there. <laughs> Thank you, Barbie Roses. <laughs> You're welcome. No limit. Tee -hee. <laughs> well, let's see what Von Buren did. Well, Got rid of that sub in that Z zone. With all that stuff he got rid of a single cruiser of Russia's. Oh boy, what a baby! <laughs> yeah, let's see what else he did. Now well, he bombed the factories of Ukraine and Leningrad with no damage to himself again. I swear his uh, bombers are enchanted. Da damage, damage them both on the max. Full factors. Who cares? <laughs> You'll probably inherit those bomb up factors anyways. <laughs> you did it to yourself, Bob Buren. <laughs> and for some reason he took over worthless Belarusia. But more on that later. He ain't there now. And he took over East Poland. <laughs> and what else? Yeah, he took over Karelia as well. He's on a cusp of Leningrad. Yeah, boy, that's what Germany did. Let's see what uh, Russia did. Or the Warden. Well, R Warden. <laughs> Look what the Warden did. He took back his Belarusia. No, not Belarusia. Bes Bessarabia. What am I talking about? I get those two confused. That's Be Belarusia. Bessarabia. Which... Bob Buren foolishly took in the first place a worthless piece of territory, but <laughs> Stalin took it over, and this is the, the losses from that battle. Oh, that was a big battle. If you watched um, Warden's Russia video, he lost about what? Yeah, about 17 troops, but Germany, they lost what? 12 troops, 6 tanks, and a couple artilleries. And Warren survived with all his tanks and, uh, and his uh, artillery as well. <laughs> well, well Va Von Buren, you asked for it. <laughs> Didn't think he'd do it, but he did. Well, let's see, what else? Well, well, he's just daring Japan to attack him there. <laughs> but Japan's not taking the bait. <laughs> Chickenly. Uh, speaking of Japan, let's see what Japan did. Well, he declared war. In the U.S., they took over the Philippines. And it, for some reason, they took over my Crete Child, closed down my Burma Road in Yunnan. Uh, even that did a couple of daring zero attacks by give, limiting if it's zeros, a couple of infantry in Shansi and Siam. That's pretty bold, but it worked for him. Yeah, he bunched all the way up there. Uh, and Hunan for some reason. <laughs> and even, even even baby Toja took over my Guam, worthless territory. You shall pay for your insolence, <laughs> Grandmaster Tojo. <laughs> Good boy. Now you got MacArthur mad, and you'll see why. Uh, well, like I said, it's a US turn and China's vote. Well, US first, shall we? Well, you always have 79 IPCs to spend. They're going to spend all of it. 
All of it, exactly. They're going to produce an aircraft carrier with a fighter and dive bomber, a couple of artilleries for the East U.S., a couple more transports, a couple more infantry for the US, U.S., and for the Pacific, by transport, a man and artillery. I declare three battles, we'll have around seven non combats. So let's get to it. Going over five minutes of my video. Oh yeah, one more thing, I forgot. Uh, if you notice, I painted all my infantries. Well, I dabbed, paint tipped them, as you see. Now they got a face. I distinguished, this would be a drab piece. I painted the face and hands of all my, all my infantries, finally. On the board, and I used this. A peach color of uh, acrylic paint, non-water-based, of course, and it worked pr pretty good. It only took me a deep peach color. It's pretty good. And all my favorite trees are like that for all nations. And it took me hours to do. I think I had about 50 for each country to do, and I did them all. Mm -hmm. I think it looks cool. They don't look so drab. You can see the Chinese there. <laughs> and one more thing, and I, 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 I recommend you uh, paint tip it like as well as to the paint the hands and the faces, or well, the face and the hands. <laughs> it only took about, about about 30 seconds to a minute to uh, do each piece, so it didn't take that long. Doing 50 pieces, so that's well over a few hundred pieces there, <laughs> so it takes a while. And also, uh, Pilato was asking me about my dive bombers, particularly Vitaly. Well, since I, did, I never bought this G40 game with uh, the pieces, so I have no dive bombers. I don't like those dive bombers anyways, or attack bombers as they call them. I don't even like calling them attack bombers. It sounds too much like strategic bombers. I just call them dive bombers. So I, I got this dive bomber from, uh, from another game called Attack. So I use those as dive bombers. And they fit on the carrier pretty much better than those tack, tack bombers. They, they look so much like regular bombers. It's, it's hard to fit on, on carriers too. So that's why I use these. That thing's kind of cool. And as you see, those are my Japanese dive bombers. Because <laughs> I paid tip them. And here's my uh, US dive bomber. Pink tipped them. So, I thought it was pretty cool. So there you go, Bob Palel. <laughs> Hope you do the same for yourself. Well, as I'm going eight minutes on this video, it's going to be a long video. <laughs> so let's go for the U.S., shall we? Well, I'm going to declare three battles, as I said. First one, well six. There's a, there's a pesky submarine of Von Buren's. You should have taken it out because now I'm going to... I'm gonna get rid of it with these four bombers from the U.S. I'm gonna go two spaces, one, two, all four of them. One, two, one, two, what did they have? Oh well. And also a destroyer coming from 102. That's my first one. Excuse me, uh, Barbie Roses? <laughs> And now Battle B in Morocco, defended by a troop and an artillery of, of uh, pesky Italy. They've been doing well in this game so far, but well, we're going to put an end to that. So, see some 101, I'm going to take five transports, two cruisers, carrying five men, four mechs, and one tank. We're gonna go three spaces off the seaport. Come on, come on. Work for me. Uh. They're all going into Morocco. All, all of them. Three spaces. And his carrier, too, is gonna go a couple spaces. And of course, I don't feel like taking those off. Uh, Aircrafts off the carrier, I don't because they're magnetized. But they'll have, both have 
they'll go three spaces so they both have one in their gas tanks. So it's a fighter and a dive bomber. All attacking poor Morocco. They're gonna be more poor once I'm through with it. And so I'll see in Guam where the transport. Grandmaster told you if his insolence took over. Well, I'm gonna end that insolence. Wipe that smile off his Tojo face. <laughs> My submarine coming off the seaport. Season so 54, they're gonna go three spaces. One, two, three. And eliminate that trans that transport. Hmm. Good oh boy, look at what Tojo did to me. It'll wipe out my Chinese. <laughs> All those Chinese forces I lost in China. Yeah, of course, a couple of Allied troops in Asia as well. And a couple of troops of my Americans in the Philippines. I mean, that's all he lost, Tojo. He just lost a fighter, mech, and infantry. But now I gotta add this to his total. <laughs> okay, so that's the end of that transport. So let's go to Battle A. Uh, I got four bombers, a destroyer against that submarine. So I gotta get this. Bring that dice box down for right now for this occasion. Just give me a few seconds here. It's ballet, so. Four of my bombers at a four. My destroyer at a two. Against his sub at a one. And where's that couple of mine? I'm always doing this to myself. Ugh! Oh, here it is. Well, I'll roll it all together, of course. Sub misses, but my bomb, my bomber got you. <laughs> so I didn't have to lose my lose anything out of there. So she retreated that sub, that sub, uh, Von Buren. Got to do nothing this round. Okay, now for battle B. That would be Morocco. Against those two units. I got about five troops, four, four mechs, a tank, a couple bombarding cruisers, a fighter, and a dive bomber from 0 to 4. So I'm just gonna roll. So these will be his, his two defending units at a two. I dive, by, dive bomber prone to a four. Fighter at a three. So two bombarding cruisers at a three. My, ta my tankaroonie at a three. So I'm just gonna roll those. I think I, I'll be able to get him two, two hits. Am I doing this right? Let's see. No, 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 no. I don't think I'm doing it right. Remember, I also got uh, troops and mechs in it, in there as well. But I'm just rolling with the big, big stuff first. Got one hit. 
I got the two hits, we, two required hits. Let's say the, the bombarding cruiser got him. So, uh, let me see. I gotta lose. Be losing an infantry. And Italy loses his two units there as well. And also that Italian pie out of there, pizza pie. Get out of there. So, pouring the rose. Let's see, uh, America will go. Put pie of their own in Morocco. Since they liberate it, they'll go t towards the U.S. economy. Yay! Damn, I'm good. <laughs> so that's it. End of that battle. A moment to this dice box and two. So I'm going 16 minutes. All right, so my non combat. Uh. Okay, well, okay. First one. These two trans, transports and destroyer, they're going to 91. Three spaces. I love this song. And they're gonna pick up two men, two artilleries. Can you see that? I can't. So two troops and two artillery are going to Gibraltar. And my two, my two other, how do you say, transports. All right. Okay, and this destroyer, she's on 89. It's going to 91 as well. And this carrier, also, the 102 is going to go into 91. Excellent. All right. My two other transports. I gotta pick up an artillery from Central U.S. I'm going. Three spaces. At the seaport. They'll capture Brazil. Um, Taking th three men brought it to the American uh, American uh, military. Hooray! So that's mine. So, Bop mine. I got two up my economy, I believe. Was it two? Yeah, two. Nice. So I'll be what? I'll be up to 53. After capture Morocco and Brazil, I'll be up to 53 for America. Oh yeah, I got retreat these bombers. These bombers, they have four spaces, five spaces. They'll go all the jolly old England, don't you know? All to England. Excellent. Okay, now uh, let me see. Okay, uh, these th three fighters from Hawaii. We get off the uh, air base. They're going one, two, three, four, five. They're going. They're going to go into Queensland. All three fighters. Yeah, hooray! And my American Navy. They'll be gone. <laughs> they're going to 62. Going back to 62. On, on my fleet there. There's a battleship cruiser. Uh, transport. Sub and destroyer. And of course, they're going to finally land these two troops. 
in New South Wales. That's we're on a transport assault for th three rounds. <laughs> okay, now. This destroyer from Midway is going to go two spaces to Johnson Island. See zone 30. My uh, carrier, sees on 10, is going to go three spaces. One, two, three to Johnson as well. Johnson! So you can't, you can't reach me. One, two, three, four. No, you can't reach me. So, yeah. And destroyer from sees on 10 is going to go to the other side of the world off of sea base. going three spaces to one, two, and three. Sees on 89. Excellent! Nice. Oh, I'm at it. Might as well put down my units. Uh, so I'm putting two more transports in C-Zone 101. Carrier with a plane and a dive bomber. My two men. Two artilleries in the East Coast. Excellent. And of course, transport a man and a artillery are going on the West Coast. Put it there, you can't see it right now, but I'll show it to you later. So I'm going over 20 minutes on this turn, Judas Priest. Alright, let's do the recap. Okay, East Coast, I got. Two A guns, two troops, and two artilleries in East Coast of America. He's on 101. I got a couple of transports, carrier with a plane, and a dive bomber. He's on 106. I got a destroyer. He's on 89. I got a destroyer. Brazil. I got three men, artillery. He's on 86. I got two transports. Jalio England, you got four bombers. Gibraltar, you got. I got two men and two artilleries. Morocco, I got. Right, right now it's four men represented by the blue chip. A tank and. Four, four Mex. Four Mexicans. <laughs> My favorite people. Yeah, I'm talking to you, Piloto. <laughs> Season 91, I got what? What do I got? I believe I got seven transports, yeah, seven trans two cruisers, uh, two destroyers, I believe, yeah, two carriers with three fighters and one dive bomber on it. Hooray! So that's for the Atlantic. For the Atlantic. Now for the Pacific. I'll be more, a little more Pacific here. Season 62, I believe, is a sub, destroyer, transport, Cruiser, battleship, and two men in Southern New South Wales. I got sub in Guam. Seas on 21. Seas on 30. I got what is that? Uh, carrier, empty carrier, and a destroyer. Seas on 10. I got transport, and in the West Coast, I got a man, artillery, and two AA guns. All right, so I'm going 24 minutes on here. Ugh, okay, let's get to China now. And of course, before I do that, like I said, I'm 53 on the charts. 20, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53. I get all this in NOs. 5, 10, 20. That's 20 in NOs. 10, 20. I'll be spending 
73 on my next turn. Hooray! Ah, okay. That's it with that. Let's get all this out of here now. China Wana's turn. You have 16. They're going to spend 15 of it, saving one. On five men. They're just going to have one battle. That battle's going to be in Kui Chow. Purina Kui Chow. Chow, chow, chow. Defended by three Japanese tanks, an artillery, and a mech. So from Shechuan. Got four men. They're going to go march in there. And see, we got four men there as well. We're gonna march in there as well. From Burma, we got a fighter, flying tiger. It's going one, two, and he'll have two left in his gas tank. Eight men and a fighter coming in there. That's my only battle. Battle A. And the warden, he talked me into this. But I'm the one risking my chop suey here. Hope I don't get diced here. But he says the odds are favorable, but I can get easily diced there too. If he had the strong defense. Let's see if I. So if, if this goes wrong, I'll blame Warden. <laughs> we all will blame Warden. He talked me into it, so let me get this. Dice box. Uh, dice box down. I love this dice box. Go! Oh! Goes my banger head <laughs> sign. Hope I don't have to use it. So, these three yellow dice will represent his tanks. Defending out of three. And of course, there's his two other units defending out of two. It's artillery. No, yeah, artillery and uh, mech. Well, I have tra eight troops, I believe. Four. Eight. Troops attacking at one. Of course, my fighter. Flying Tiger at three. And let's hope we trade hits here equally. All right, so there's more of my cup. There's my cup. Throw all together, of course. Oh, baby. Oh, yeah, yeah. It feels good. It feels good. I need two hits. I hope you don't get more than two hits. Ooh, ow. Oh, my God. Ooh, look at those. Man, look at this. Beautiful. You know my fighter missed. But four of my infantry has got him. One, two, three, four. Whoa, no way. Five? Oh, nice. I got five hits in my infantry. I didn't... Okay, let's see what he got. His twos miss. His twos miss. Let's see what he got. We got two sixes for his for his uh, tanks. But he got one of his tanks. Is that a two? So I got five hits to his two hits. <laughs> I'm to his one hit. Oh, thank you, Warden, for talking me into this. <laughs> I got all five of his stuff. He only got one, <laughs> one infantry of mine. I didn't expect this. I thought this was going to go badly for me. Or at least he get decimated there. So. Nice. Kui Chow's mine again. I just lose an infantry. <laughs> Thank you, Warden. Look at that. <laughs> My goodness. Five ones. I don't believe that. <laughs> And he loses three tanks, artillery, and a, and a, and a mech. Nice. And of course that Japanese rising some pie out of there too. I just lose one troop. All right, Judas Priest. Hooray for me. So let me, let me get this. I don't believe this. I didn't expect that. I thought I could get, I could either get dice or at least decimated here. So, excellent. Let me see you. Sure. 
Daddy. So this flying tiger will go back to Burma. And that's the vibe of seven men. Nice. Nicey nice. I like it. I like it a lot. Didn't expect that. Thank you, Warden, for talking me into this. I was going to do totally something else with this. Did I get rid of those tanks? Uh. Nice. All right, so... Nice. Seven, seven troops. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, seven troops in Kui Chow. And one, one, uh, how you say, flying tiger in Burma. Burma ham, <laughs> if you will. So I'll just put down my units. And let's see. I got five troops. I'm going to put one troop. So yawn. One Shen Si. And three in Shichuan. So let's just recap it. I got Flying Tiger in Birmingham. Three troops in Shichuan. Seven troops in Kui Chow. One in Shenzi and one in Suyong. And let's see. I tallied it up. I saw it should be at seven on the charts. I'm getting no winnows because Burma's, I mean, Yunnan's still controlled. But it's worth it, getting rid of all those units of Kui Chow. Nice, so I guess click seven. Five, six, seven, I saved one. So as he's spending eight for produce, production of more units, my next turn, eight. Nice, love it, love it. <laughs> uh, go over a half hour of my turn, but it was worth it, <laughs> oh baby. So stay tuned for round four. Goes on. And it'll be what? What's his face name? Uh, Warren. It's UK turn. Yeah. And let's see what he does with that Egypt right there. <laughs> the pesky Italian forces. Well, I did my part. Do your part, Warren. In Africa as well. So, gladly, this is a no limit. And stay tuned. And subscribe to Warden. Also, Grandmaster Bird and Buren and Buran as well. Ah, <sighs> they're living out.